Hi guys, this is Olga. Today I will show you how to face paint a very fast and easy one stroke dragon. I suggest you to watch till the end because I have a red dragon tutorial in this video as well. I loaded my 1 inch flat brush with sunset color block, taking one of the blues from it. Then I dipped the tip of the brush with blue into black. This will add more contrast to my dragon and I'm moving on painting. I start by making two narrow loops, this is going to be the muzzle. Then I add two more wider loops on top, which is going to be the forehead. Next, I use the dark tip of my brush and connect these two pieces in between to form the top of the dragon's mouth. Using the same side of the brush, I paint the bottom jaw, then I lay my brush flat to make the jaw angle, press it down and then lift it up. The dragon's head is almost ready, we'll leave it to dry out well and we'll move on painting the body. This part is the easiest one. You just have to lay your brush flat, pull it, creating a long curved stroke and add a loop in the middle. To paint the tail, I'm gradually twisting my brush and end up with a sharp tip at the end. Then using the same side of the brush, I'm painting the tip of the tail. I felt that my brush gave all the paint away so I reloaded it and went back on the loop with another paint layer. Now when the head is dry, we can paint the ears. I'm using the dark side of my brush and making two strokes with a gap in the middle for each ear. To embellish the body, I'm adding some spikes in the back. Again, this is very easy to do. Just use your sharp side of the brush and move it back and forward. For the light details, I'm loading a small angle brush with the opposite side of the split cake, then dip the sharp tip of the brush into white. For the fluff in the ears, I'm painting with the sharp side of my brush, directing it with a sharp tip into the gap, press it there and then flick it out. Sorry for the camera angle here, guys, unfortunately you can't see my hand, so you'll just have to trust me. Using the sharp tip of my brush, I'm painting the eyes and the teeth. And I must tell you that it was even easier than using a regular round brush. Next, I'm adding some of fluff on the beard and moustache, always starting the strokes with flat and adding up with sharp tips. To frame the belly, I'm using the flat side of my brush and making some sort of square stroke starting from the edge of the belly and flicking the brush into the gold part. As you can see, the gold creates a beautiful airy transition between belly scales and blue back. Last step is adding thin and small details with a number one round brush and black. All done, but stop, watch the video till the end. So many of you requested to see a red dragon in this technique, so here you go. I speeded up this fragment so you don't fall asleep while watching, it usually takes longer to paint a design on camera. In real life, this dragon design is super fast to paint, it takes me only 3 minutes or even less to paint on a gig, and the second good part of it is that it looks so impressive and so intricate that it always surprises my clients. The head is the part that will require more practice, but I'm certain that you are going to nail it. And I'd love to see your dragons, so please share them with me on Facebook or tag me on Instagram via all this Facebook art. 
As usually, you can find all the materials used in this video as well as my contacts in the description box. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, please support me with a thumbs up and I can't wait to see your attempts, bye bye!